so actually we're gonna visit our Amazon base of books and this is a trilogy of our set block research the first version on it of it probably I'm gonna see how we respond to the market so you can learn about the technology we have built uh, you're going to give us the credit of the writing the three copyrights and also knowing where the concept come from uh, if you're interested to integrate services based upon this research we can have a prompt discussion you know I'm gonna like that uh, probably you're gonna have the outcome you want and both sides you and I gonna make the most out of all of this for those who are who have interest in technologies so I'm gonna go first on my account so I'm gonna click as an editor so you're going to see all of these uh, books I'm working actually on the Hurricane and the seven figures into the billionaire scale the nice thing there will be uh, available by 2024 this open for pre-order so you can be on the list so you can be the first one to be had by supporting our pre-order stage so this is our books we have here so and this is the all point we have we earn 400 for this certain book and 200 for those all other kind of. so and yes i'm working also on this uh, back into half which is the entire and reactive the story of the planets so kind of we make some decision and things become kind of bad for human beings to support staying on earth so we found a way to get out and to find other places on the universe starting by the moon as a transit for the trip so after the moon, the moon the story will be Mars and other planets mostly planet for resources you know other planets do have water we want probably we can find we can find with in other planet probably we're gonna explore on the book. So the story is starting by very hacky we're gonna lose his pet and then what's gonna happen they're gonna offer him because you know like every kids it's up that when you lose something uh, you won't you won't you won't have it back you know so you hope that if you have it back you're gonna have something equal or better so sadness happened not at a time so and I'm gonna try to find way to try to make you don't feel that sad of how life is you know life, so. and for this book and they brought him a robot and the robot was accepted the things just like probably the rob robots was kind of better than having a cat but it's always a good thing to see reactive parents you know for young kids and as it was Christmas having a gift before everybody you know really really in the house where really, really makes sense uh, at the sadness level so the sad part of it won't be there you know so They'll be rejoicing to rejoice Christmas for a kid after using his pet. So and then as it was a robot, it's where the interest started in all kind of things around robotics. You know, we grew up a lot of things based on things. 
we have been full or we have been brief and our child will you know sometimes you can have the power to direct your life into a certain profession or sometimes it can give you interest to become a builder a creator uh, one or two scientists so and a kid end up to develop for his first job at a certain because they have cooperation or uh, leagues you know you can name it corporation leagues or companies you know the man was the future society and then the other one was the oral league there wasn't really both antagonists but kind of you know because oral league really really believe in that nostalgic part of human heart that the best thing to do is to go back to have and probably learning that my assumption probably learning from our mistakes when solving what we have been wasting but it's really hard at that time for people to make a living money and why the future society model was kind of accepting that orally concept but first grabbing things from elsewhere but also finding a shelter a place you know where to build that something close or something livable for the humankind so gonna have more tools and also more time to think about what you're gonna do with those tools when back in, into earth so the motto was expansionism with progressism so and then the description of what used which kind of technology created the needs of getting water from planet with a lot of water tracking them through some kind of technologies and to be able to be consumed by plant we're gonna grow or ourselves to drink you know so the our technology is around recreating or kind of a place elsewhere other than half for humankind to make a living and to start building uh, new places to make a living you know so and then after learning from this planet building more sophisticated tools we're gonna come back to earth well equipped i mean mentally and physically technologically to solve problem and issue just like the oral league believe it you know uh, antelo will be the first robot after we grow up an adult when working for one of the two future society company it was an antelo robot with an ai embedded ai both turing test and even more you know so that the fix so you're gonna be probably an anime a 3d anime probably some books like comics who knows <laughs> let's see what's gonna comes up out of it so we need talent many people master those technology use on film of pretty writing comics let's say uh, illustration for comics because it's and the story will be written just like find way to match bubbles on the comics books with images not those kind of things so i'm gonna because the intent was to go on the on the account so i can see my name here on the click so 400 points someday be, uh, like two months ago it was a 600 i don't know what happened it goes down at 400 so whatever let's see what's gonna come up soon so i write to complaint about it to amazon to try to see why it back up
to 600 it's not really normal so these are books we have available here and these are books also published in different languages from my first book uh, in French L'Arme du Leader they have been translating in Spanish Portuguese and so on and the books is there the last one 44 L'Arme du Leader really there is blue and somewhere with something on the hand the F on the hand and there is a second design, it's more friendly to what I like the most, Freddy, and it's a Freddy kind of third person, not turn on the movie uh, Jack or Jackson, you know, people travel from dogs, I don't know, you know what, what I mean, turn, uh, people on properties, you know, the movie, it's really beautiful. I like that design. Okay, so we're gonna go back to aircon. So aircon is my actual work on how because I really have another time to see crypto how they make money, you know. Uh, for Bitcoin they say there is an algorithm going to solve some kind of puzzle and then probably Here's a proof there is a work done and, and the work produce something. As far as I remember that what I heard, you no, know, it can be true or false. But if it's true, I don't really see which kind of person in the world they serving. At least it can be processing power or HDD power or SSD power, I don't know. Some kind of virtual base, containers of powers made of CPU and, and memories for use like server for gaming. Just like we try we, we try we start putting that kind of things in place with the set block search. But we don't know which one, you know. The probably you can see so I'm gonna just shut down that part to go back to the book. Aircon and Airmax Roadmap. The cryptomatic of money. So that's my research, uh, the last book of the research I have done. And I keep working on this book, but the two first kind of, okay, probably I'm going to hunt more graphs. So I have 6 million line of coding on the all platform. And also I have the hosting service I have to handle because the technical office at that place, they are not really, 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 really the way I want them. But the reason why I want to build platform, this is a demo or prototype we need for people to be able to see how it looks like, how it works, you know. Those kind of things are really important for investor, capital risk, even business engine, whatever people driving money inside this platform. And also for a company willing to create fast and forward business using an all-in-one crypto platform they can buy with license. And also you buy it, we come to install it, we personalize it, just like an ERP or uh, an accounting system like Sage, or I don't know how to name that, uh, client, client base server Sage, so you gotta put the accounting chart in place, you gotta put a lot of things in place, you know. Accounting chart means name of, for every kind of account, receivable or payable account, you know account for insurance, account for everything. So they, 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 you can have two companies with totally different accounting system because whatever the, the accounting cycle is almost the same, can be the same, but the system or the chart is totally, can be totally different. This one, with Cerberus, I'm really interested about a lot of things like LBOs because they mostly drive merge and acquisition. And the caviar with merge and acquisition is just like you pay a lot of money to the intermediary company or the company between those two sides, you know, because you have to be able to translate the first accounting system and chart into the new company. Sometimes they don't just talk the same chart language. So those are things I can add as parentheses or bracket in what I'm presenting, so the cryptomatic of money. 
pieces of money. So, said block research is built is building a crypto platform with a core base on aircon theory. And an aircon is not meant to be a product nor a service. It's at range between both a product and a service. I think at mid range. I will have that mid range. Okay. As you may know, a service is not something you can touch or see. It's a task executed by a certain entity or system for a scheduled financial outcome with lending criteria within a deadline. And a product is something made out, a recipe or methodology following a certain kind of order and available for sale to people. The Hercom theory is the cryptomatics or set of crypto mathematics used to explain how everything works on the set block platform to establish all exchanges for transactions and every operation to be able to generate gains or a certain gain. It's the same thing. Okay. Concerning Aircon, we will first define a basic point to start named initiation and it can be an initial deposit of a certain currency, a time slot or cycle, or any other cryptocurrency. Then we will put the basis into work and based upon that time used in the system, it will be it will generate a certain result, return or Profit. But every wave drive profit. Okay. So what we have to remember here is to know that Hercon is a non-tangible asset made of ones and zeros backed with scheduled profit gain or benefits we named to be wave so hercon will be the cone itself and everything every fraction generating from it will be named mark so we have hercon and its air marks or its marks it's the same thing that's what we will be having and have so if it's not the done we will be having if it's done it's half it's just like I try to take the time I will be implementing this one if it's already done because I not yet 100% integrate everything because I need a lot of side aside to the, the set block platform you have the servers, the general chief name platform. Oh. It could be simple, it could be it could be putting numbers. No. I have an idea about it, so as long as you don't have that idea not yet written, I won't be able to talk about it a lot. So because we work on men when starting. But I don't believe in random made men. You know, personally, I'm a scientist, biostatistics certified Bloomberg School of Public Health at John Hopkins University. Uh, I, I'm really pragmatic with the, all math magic I have done, all exact science I have done about things. I'm really 
achievement for me, of course, or for the study or the research program is a mem control and generate it based our own and only own needs. It could be generated through a competition of video game, a business event, or whatever event we will be organizing. So we not we I'm not trying to don't be passive to run down event happening online, you know. And we know where they are, we can come with our payment system, adding our part of it, and they're gonna make profit. We're gonna make profit too. So we're gonna explain if we your mem make people spend some kind of things, this is our payment system. Put that at the core of the mem and we have a percentage from you and me. So we all both make profit from that noise, you know. Just like a competition for video game happening, uh, Setcon or Aircon is the sponsor. So ticket will be purchased by converting into the Aircon at the web page or on the transaction side. You know, that kind of things can and the mem produce an effect. Because I don't know how passive and random mem work to make profit, you know. A bunch of kids, a bunch of geek or kids making noise online. Don't necessarily drive into profit, right? It can drive some more drama, more noise, sometimes useless noise. So I don't believe in that kind of things for a business. Just like said someone, one day I was by San Francisco, by the San Francisco Harbor, uh, close to the Federal Reserve. I was thinking about the formation of a business between LLC Corporation, CNS Corporation. And it shows up after some minutes I finish. We start talking about all of this. Not haircut, but crypto stuff. And uh, all thing I remember he said, like, on crypto, uh, something like that, and he said, real business, right? Yeah, I said, yes, real business. Because most of crypto, I don't know for what reason, the non-profit, no. I don't understand who gonna file for taxes and nobody trying to show because there is no entity, no. This company will make trillion of dollars, you no. Know? Banks make billion of dollars, trillion of dollars, you know, they don't hide themselves. Even to take benefits out of taxes because tax is not just a filing or a payment, it can give you more benefits back, you know. So that one also have to fall on someone. But I feel like some people want to take the responsibility. But when you're going to come to get the benefits, probably you try to show up. And we're going to get caught. They're going to ask you, what did you file previously to your duty? No. So why you need benefits? <laughs> so that's the funny part of it. People want money, but they don't want to be accountable. So that's what we will be having and have, let's say all have, and to work in the set block platform to be able to fulfill our three pillar as business principles, privacy, wealth, and freedom. You know, you know all about the three worlds. They are not new worlds, you know, most of the people know what does it mean. But for us, we have a much more deep science, you know. Privacy is really an important factor into life, you know. Whatever you have money or not, you want to have your private side where you do your things privately and nobody have to know about it. The way you're spending your money, you don't want people to know that it's not really the business. At least there is an investigation, you know, some kind of things can be checked. But for your daily day to day living, you are an adult, nobody have to say tell you stuff about how you spend your money and why you spend it whatever the good or bad. But if you find that if you need advice, you can receive advice from people. But whatever gonna happen to your life, you have to be responsible for it. So privacy is almost the side of being safe, you know, almost close to safety. No. 
because you don't want to get hurt because the right the wrong person get inside your circle and get out with the wrong information it can be mislead a lot of people when the information was totally wrong you know so the time you solve that so we have a lot of problem so wealth is building wealth no protecting financially your family and yourself and for us we intend to build that that the intent and we do that realism so and then we have freedom financial freedom the freedom of traveling everywhere and knowing that your money is safe on your crypto wallet and the freedom of buying things using a sequence of letter and number everywhere in the world really really makes sense you know you don't have to apply for a card waiting at the bank you know if you have problem you know you have a outline and you have a series of numbers and letter everywhere you're gonna go to buy things so opening an account everywhere in the world doesn't really matter for you no more because every time you're ready because cryptocurrencies interact with every kind of currencies you know so everywhere you're welcome to buy things you know such a beautiful world right and everywhere you're welcome to have bonuses because our platform will work around those rewards based program with partner you know I don't do that myself, Ray, hanging out somewhere, writing numbers. No, we, need, we use automation. We use, part, we, we, we use automation, we work with partner, and then we grow our circle of partner, because that's the intent. Professional and serious-based partner, there is no kidding here. There is no random here. And if that happens, we try to solve that. And for myself, I really had and I had the status quo, you know, and I fight it every day. So, that's the thing. So, we are looking for interesting partners for the distribution of our crypto platform as fast way to build a crypto business through a licensing program. We also have new products, C-Hub or Clever, CQ app or Clever app. And services available to fit the US or any other market here we have some demo link or prototype demo link let's say that for what we built and the milestone we have reached so we have this all links you know the set block platform for the native con the native con is the basic con just like the coin you use like for people to interact and then we have the corporate coin the corporate coin is just like a native coin but it's the corporate coin because it's linking to corporate based activities you know company want to build up with your system you know company want to build a system with your system company want to interact with the platform using your systems of encryption for apis or system of the same kind they use corporate and the profit generating around gonna be on corporate base core that's the core the set core because we have the set core and the set con the native core set core is interact at some point with the corporate you know based on some kind of algorithm but they still kind of separate from each other. The setcon itself and the core for corporation activity or for corporate based activities. You know, so you're gonna have a login, things you're gonna use, you're gonna have links you're gonna create, you're gonna have things you're gonna monitor. For those who watch my YouTube, you can see a lot of video on on YouTube. We we have a lot of them. You know, testing from first testing or platform. Uh, Fibonacci testing, you know, a lot of things like crypto based testing and uh, the first and then test we did on creating a blockchain. Blockchain, you know, we have the first version and then we have the, the latest.
It's like the first recall was empty. And then I found out where to don't have it empty. We create a non-lazy version uh, where we're creating recall from the beginning uh, until the hand automatically. So, and now we have this whole platform online available with all CC activate so people can try to test it, mostly companies because we need partners. And then we have uh, an example of C app which is the uh, SW checker. Checker mostly when you open uh, a, a, an account, you have a crypto wallet address, a sequence of number, mostly 64 if I'm not wrong. And then we use that wallet to, to test that it's already online, you know. You use the checker. If it's online and it belongs to us, it's going to be green. If it's not, sequence number, it will be red. Any wallet address belonging to us, it will be green. That is an evidence or a test of our API, you know. And there is no connection to any database we have, but there is connection through an API. So you don't have to have a lot of password from our every database we have. No, we just have one single place of operation, which is an API or something around what you name to be an API. That's the first illustration on it. And then we have the SBA which is the safe block authentication technology. It's a kind of multi-factor authentication, but the reason, because it don't work the same way, is not built around the same kind of technology, because we use flash memory, and we use the push, check, and pull technology. You know, that difference, we don't use database. At least database can be used on our admin for payment, you know, to recall credit card and so on and so on, user, you know, it needs a user and such, those kind of things. But the technology itself don't use database. Database are used at the other side, you know, the payment side. Because, you know, you, you need to put your name, first name, you know, uh, credit card stuff, you know, you have to be recorded some, somewhere, but the technology for payment, they have to be we call it somewhere for payment, you know, and payment have to be having history for yourself to be sure that you pay already and you can even print those payment recall. Drop of your accounting system. Those kind of things. Use database. But the technology itself don't use any database. They use, we use flash. And Genesis Lab Tools for uh, Biotech, it's a platform for a lot of tools probably. Who knows, we're going to have Genesis 1, 2, or Genesis this, this, Genesis Lab, Genesis whatever. But what I'm trying to say, like the first intent for me to create this Genesis is because of classification and lab. You know, I have seen a lot of uh, things from my childhood and now happening around me or around the world you know i know that things happen sometimes we can have an unknown pathogen virus or bacteria i don't know what it is and then we we'll receive the sample and we're going to test it anywhere where people can be infected but the what the things i'm trying to drive is just like having classification of lab you know could be interesting because you will bring an unknown sample at any kind of lab you have to see the classification so i found out that the classification don't exist yet so reason why for me having the classific the classification of lab laboratory makes sense you know we can have the highest one i don't know level three or i don't know alpha and the alpha can be uh, handled by robots exclusively by robots because they are really made for unknown and totally unknown pathogen. You know, if this shows up in the world and you have sample by robot and robot will examine and you're having the sequencing. So when we're going to have the sequencing so we can know how to
to better appreciate the pathogen, the virus or the kind of bacteria, so we can have more ease to have action to it and create using containers filled by robot of this pathogen to send probably to a lower version because now we have more information about the pathogen. We have been doing testing through a certain kind of reactive or principal principle you know, ingredient reactive or uh, how many that active ingredient. So we totally showed that the pathogen won't be a danger for level medium level laboratories but that classification in real world even in US don't exist so reason why that tool will drive this kind of tool and the, the biotech genesis will drive this kind of tool a classification with services on it so that just uh, that's what I can give you about that kind of thing because you know an unknown pathogen we find out I don't know where in Africa in Asia or here in US or in Europe Sometimes it can happen without thinking people can bring that here in Stanford and we don't know the classification of the lab. You're going to study, you get infected because you don't know how it reactive, how it react to people, how it spread. Is it a pathogen or a virus spreading from people to people? You know, you don't know. And you're going to get a girlfriend. And we're gonna have a party that night. We're all infected, you know. And it spread just fast than the wind, and we all dead by tomorrow morning. That's a story uh, we don't want to write, you know. A story nobody don't want to tell to people. So reason why the Genesis project for me makes sense. So as far as I remember look like I forget nothing about this whole thing, you know. Uh, my time is kind of expiring to talk. So I'm going to wish you to have a nice and wonderful day. Don't, don't forget, my name is Ray Herman Angosio Lewa. I'm U.S. Federal Tax Professional, Life Coach with Tax Advices, and I'm also a scientist. Have a nice and wonderful day. And this is my set of book for my research and studies, personal studies. Have a great day.